Welcome to Mother Bird Blog. and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Zara and I'm 22, mummy to two girls, Ruby and Lucy. And today's video is my evening skincare routine. I have actually done one of these before, but recently I went for an oxygen facial and I have learned so much about what I am doing wrong. So I'm about to tell y'all. Are you ready? Let's go. So to begin with, I'm gonna crack on and then whilst I'm putting the products on my face, we can have a little chin wag there. So to start off with, I'm actually using the Clarins Pure Melt Cleansing Gel. This is quite cool. This comes out as a gel. Can you see? Can you see? And I just pop this all over my face. It starts as a gel and you put it on a dry face and basically it turns into an oil on your skin. So when you've got makeup on today, I didn't wear makeup on. Um, it melts all your makeup off. So basically, I went for an oxygen facial. If you wanna see that, the video is actually on the channel. Just look back. And I learned so much what I'm doing wrong. To start off with, the first thing I have stopped, guys, is uh, picking spots, which I know was wrong and bad, but you know. And what was the trigger to stop me from doing it? Well, she said, do to your skin what you would do to your child's face. Would you pick your child's spot? No, so stop picking your own spots. Now I'm gonna go get a bit of water for my face. So my cleanser is all rubbed in. That got a boosty there. And it's all like an oil on my face. I put a bit of water and this turns it into like a cleansing milk. I'm gonna rub this in circles all over my face. So basically, what I was doing wrong, I was picking spots, so top tip, do what you do to child's face to your brain. So start picking. I was over exfoliating, I was doing all these different face masks in the thing that it was helping all my spots, and she said it's not. She said stop doing all the latest fad masks. You know, people are like, oh, buy this mask, it will help your spots. It won't. The camera's not picking up, but this is going like milky like a cleansing milk. But no, all these face masks will not help your face. She says, at the end of the day, your skin needs very basic things. Cleanse, tone, moisturize, morning and night. It's literally that simple. She said, stop with all the fads, stop with all the excess products. A lot of the time, they're drying your skin out, doing bits and bobs like that. So I was like, honey, why have I not been told this sooner? The amount of money I've spent on all these bloody skin masks stops now. Now I'm just going to go rinse this off. Hold up. Now my face is all rinsed off and clean. So the second product is my toning lotion with chamomile. It's alcohol free and this is the beauty. And I'm just going to put that on a cotton pad and go over my face. So as I was saying, just go back to basics with your skin hand. I actually have always been treated for oily skin, but I don't even have oily skin. All the Clarins counters, all things like that have previously got me wrong. I've actually got dry skin, and my face, because I have all these oily products, it goes into overdrive, creating more oil on my face, because it's like, man, your face is really dry, which creates more spots. So by treating it because it's actually dry and giving it what it needs, stops all the excess oils and stops all the extra spots. Brilliant, right? I get loads of black dots on my nose. Camera's not gonna pick it up because you know, Cameron's my best friend. But I get loads of black dots and they're not actually blackheads. In fact, they're oxidized pores, she said. So that is where I've been squeezing my nose, getting all these bits of like white stuff out. And I was like, yeah, I'm popping all these blackheads when I'm actually not. I'm ridding the, the skin of its natural oils which creates more black dots because it's actually hitting the surface and turning black. It's not even dirt. Like, man, I've been doing this so wrong my whole life. So I'm leaving these and they will hopefully calm down and I'm going to see her again in two weeks. It was that good of facial. And that'll help loads. Kids outside my road plane. Boo, didn't need a backing track. Face is all toned. She said, stop washing your face with water as well. You know when you're in the shower and you're like, oh, I'll give my face just a quick wash. Oh, it's water, it's fine, leave it. Because that's a different pH level to your skin, which will dry your skin out more. Like, oh. 
Sure is a gem of knowledge, all right. Next up, I'm using a face cream. I am now using, I have been using the Estee Lauder, but it's just run out, so I bought a cheapo one to tide me over until, y'all know, money's a bit more spare. This is the Urban Skin Defense. It's Factor 20 Nivea. I think it was about eight pounds. So it comes in a little pot like this, and it's green. And to be fair, I quite like it, look. And I just put that on. And that is literally my skincare routine. She said it is equally important to put moisturiser on in the day as it is in night. I always thought night more because everyone says, oh, your skin repairs yourself more at night. But actually, it's important in the day because you protect it from all the pollutants in the air. You're protecting it from skin damage, from the sunlight. She said even in winter, as soon as that sun rises, it's damaging your skin. So wear SPF and it will help your ageing. And since I've started to follow all of her tips, I've literally gone back to basics. For all of you that used to watch my lives and stuff, I literally do no exfoliator masks, no scrubs, anything. I'm literally just leaving, your skin is such a clever organ, I'm just leaving it to do what it knows best. And it has got so much better. Like, oh, the camera's not showing it, apart from that, like, that's just sticking all that little friend there. But I've not picked it, so are we proud or are we proud? It'll get covered up, it's fine. But like, look at my skin now. Look how glowing my skin is compared to what it used to be. Honestly, hands. There's your top tips of the day. You know, there is so much that I learned and I just thought I'd give you all some like pop, 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 quick fire facts for you all. Don't wash your face in water. Take you back to basics. Forget the mask, forget the fads that they're all trying to sell you. For like, oh, this one will change your life. Well, it didn't, Shirley, it didn't. And I'm going to wrap it up there because I'm waffling once again. So I hope you liked my updated evening skincare routine. This is what I'm doing now, and it's honestly working wonders for my skin. Stripping it back to basics, none of the fancy crap. You know, I got your back, sisters. I hope you like what you saw today. If you did, make sure that you give us a like. Drop us a comment if you have any skincare tips, facts, infos. You know, hit us up and we'll be like a gem of knowledge altogether. We'll be like a volcanic explosion of skincare knowledge just erupting through the universe. And make sure you subscribe. Come join the Mother Bear blog family. Love you all. See you all soon.